Mark Peterson is leading yet another amazing KXOI4 Extreme Team Project. This time, our own Robin Nance putting the team to work for her charity, Teen and Kid Closet. Robin started the nonprofit 10 years ago to clothe kids in foster care and rebuild their confidence and self-esteem. Well, now Teen and Kid Closet has a new, bigger location that needed a little TLC. Mark, Robin's probably kept you very busy, hasn't she? <laughs> Yes, we came up with some great ideas. DKI came in and took out all the walls. We worked with the city on a plan, got our permits. One of the things that we came up with, and, and again, Bryce, thank you very much, and Spokane uh, Hardware Supply, is this barn door and this corner. Now, let's show you how it all started this morning. Uh, it was a little crazy. We had lots going on. We were still trying to figure out how things were going to work. But, uh, man, we got in here. We used my fence out of my backyard. We used uh, Miramac Metal from the... Uh, other extreme team we just did with Recovery Cafe. Robin was here. She was helping. Uh, we had that plus we had Lauren and her crew from uh, Target North Point coming in for the kids area, which the board of directors have already sat in, and we'll post those pictures tomorrow. All right, Stacy joining me now. She's on the board of directors, and you also help run this thing. What do you think so far? I do. I love it. I'm so excited, especially for the back room. Um, we had a <laughs> tiny little spot in our old space where I could sort and go through clothes, and so just having that nice big space back there where I can fold clothes and get clothes ready to put out onto the store will be awesome. Did you see what River City Solid Services did? Did you see this? Did you see this? Come here. Can, can we can we show them there? So there's the whole new folding area back there. Uh, all of that has been been done, and so it's it's going to really I think help facilitate and make it easy because you have so much more room to fill. Plus you're doing you have tiny children with teen and kids closet. Yes, we do. <laughs> so it's going to be a lot more clothes, um, but I just want the Spokane community to know how appreciative we are for all of the awesome donations, and um, and the kids love getting brand new socks and underwear and things like that. So And they need it. They need, they need it. it. It's yeah. a self-esteem thing. It's a thing that everyone deserves to have some nice clothes. All right, so tomorrow morning, starting at 5 a.m., good morning, Northwest. Nadine, I'm going to be in tracking some of the weather that's coming in, and and Robin will be here uh, explaining what we're doing and what's going on. She's been an integral, integral part. You know, she's been a part of it. <laughs> she helped found it. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> yes.